During our Farm Basics time today, we're going to talk a little about nitrogen stabilizers and what this really comes back to, and especially if you're a non-farmer, I want you to think about nitrate in the water. There are a lot of people that get worried about farmers over applying nitrogen. Well, what many farmers use is nitrogen stabilizers to keep the nitrogen in the field rather than in the water. So we wanted to explain exactly how these things work today. I think, Brian, one of the things too here is when we travel abroad, we see different things. Like for example, when we were in Israel, we saw right on bottled water, it showed how many parts per million of nitrate were in the water. And that made me nervous because I had never seen that before. Wait, wait a minute, they don't do this in the United States. Well, plus when you, don't, got... when you don't read Hebrew, it's a little tough. <laughs> well, that was too, <laughs> but we figured out pretty quickly it was 8.3 parts per million. Well, eight parts per million of nitrate in the water, is that a level we need to worry about? Absolutely not. And the fact is, when we did a little more digging, there's nitrate in all water. It's just a matter of how much is there going to be. So 10 parts per million of nitrate nitrogen is the drinking water standard in the United States. So if it's 10 parts per million or less, it's deemed as safe. That's the first thing we want you to understand. The second thing is with soil in general, there is what we would call heavy soil that can hold more of all nutrients. There's what we call light soil. So sand, for example, would be light soil and it's easy to leach things out like nitrate. So what farmers try to do is keep nitrogen in the ammonium form rather than the nitrate form. And one of the ways they do that is by using nitrogen stabilizers. Nitrogen stabilizers will prevent that ammonium from converting over to nitrate. So the big thing that we always tell non-farmers is look, farmers aren't trying to waste money. They're trying everything they possibly can to save money. So they wanna keep as much nitrogen in the field as possible. And one of the ways they do that is by using nitrogen stabilizers. And again, what these things do is help prevent nitrogen moving from the ammonium form, which locks into soil and is not leachable, to the nitrate form, which would be leachable. So this is a very important thing that is used on many farms across the United States and really across the world. Well, another important thing that farmers are doing is controlling our weed of the week. Can you identify this week's weed? 